Hey guys, what's your for two here? I'm just gonna show you guys something that I recently looked at. And I recently sent in an email to um somebody. Um what's his name? I already forgot his name. Um anyway, go on to Google. Trying to in Electrix RC. Electrix RC. I want to show you guys something. You know how the ruckus, the monster truck that I have, is made by Electrix RC? Well, let me show you this. It kind of changed the name a little bit. It's probably still Electrix RC, but it's ECX. You may be wondering what that is. Well, let me show you the vehicles that they first had. They had this thing called the Boost. Right there. Ten scale buggy, electric, two wheel drive. I may end up getting a two wheel drive buggy. Come with parts, media, and everything. And then they had the um, Ruckus. Nice looking monster trucks. What I got. I recommend you get this if you're starting out. You may be looking at the chassis real quick. Just, just take a look at it. Let me actually get you a picture of the chassis, real quick. Take a look at the side view of the chassis. Just remember what that looks like. Actually, yeah, just remember what that looks like. And now, let's go to the top view of the chassis. See, similar, yeah, very. Now just remember what that looks like. I'll get to that in a second. Let me just go to vehicles. Down to the circuit, which is a 10 scale stadium truck. Right there, nice looking. These are about $100 and $110 and everything. They're very durable. I don't even know what this chassis looks like. Anyway, again, this is, don't, don't worry about the chassis. Anyway, so do you remember what the Ruggis chassis looked like? Well, I sent in a request asking. Well, kind of like a question asking if they would come out with a short course truck. And they said that they were in the making of one. Well, I sent that in like a month ago. Well, let me show you what they have. This thing called the Torment. Yes, a short course truck for around $110. Just go check them out at electricsrc.com. And if you're ready to get in a short course truck, start with the two wheel drive or something. Because this is very durable. Or a bashing short course truck or something. I mean, just look at that aggressive tread on the tires. Nice looking bumper. I don't have one of these. I may want to get one. Just because it's simply durable. I actually, I may do a conversion from my rockets. You'll see why. But just take a look at it. It's nice. It comes in red and black and red and black and orange and black. It's nice looking. Let's go to multimedia. And now let's take a look at this chassis from the top. Looks similar. Looks very similar. It's got the same chassis as the Ruckus. So a lot of it shares the same parts. Just, it's just got Nerf bars on the chassis. That's kind of really the main noticeable difference. And then you got these short course tread tires and a bumper. A, a longer bumper. This one actually looks like a bumper. The other one was kind of just like a stud. I'm not saying it wasn't a bumper. I'm just saying it was kind of like a stud type thing. And then you got these actual rubber mud flats in the back. Well, I'm guessing they're rubber. They're, I, don't, I don't know. I don't have this yet. Well, I shouldn't say yet because I don't know if I'll get one. I'll probably get one or do a conversion kit, but it's a nice looking bumper. Same power plant. The, um, dynamite system no it's not a receiver speed control together it's a dynamite ECX 1070 from Horizon Hobbies incorporated anyway it's a brushed system 20 turn motor anyway it's pretty nice looking truck and yeah you guys should check this out let me just show you another view it's got the, I'm guessing the same shocks. 
Is there plastic body shocks? But I, I don't feel the need that you... I mean, you can upgrade. But I like it stock. Because to me it's just awesome that way. I mean, it's working perfectly stock. I'm not saying that you shouldn't upgrade or should upgrade whatever. Just you can do whatever you want. But anyway, 20 turn motor, dynamite. I still have my stock motor. I just... Or here, the 20 turn. I just kind of broke a wire off of the terminal right there. But yeah, yeah, definitely, if you're in the market, you got, um, let's see how much it is here. You got uh, $150, $160. Definitely get it. Right there, $160 from electricsrc.com. I mean, two-wheel drive short course. I'd recommend you get this because I got the Ruckus, and it's a pretty strong vehicle and now let me just see if they have tires I seem to remember tires I kind of seem to remember tires let me just do a quick search same gearing and everything You can get the Spectrum DSM receiver and everything. It's a mud flap, yeah. So it is. Um, it is. Um, what? It, what do you call it? It is rubber. So I can't seem to find the short course tires, but I remember seeing some. They had like on-road ones. Oh, and this does come with a slipper clutch. I remember. So. Let's see what they have in accessories for. You just scroll down. They can, you can get a um, a fuse, ten scale, um, three thousand eight hundred kV ESC and motor combo brushless. You can also get the five thousand eight hundred combo. You can get lipo batteries, two cell with twenty C discharge, or the thirty C discharge, seven point four volts. This one's five thousand milliamp hours. It's about doesn't say the price. 20C with the Dean's connector. Oh, here they go. You got your charger. And you got your speed treads, breakaway, SC tire. Two of them per set. It's a nice looking tread that they have there. And then they have their on road tires, which I need to get me a pair. Because I want to race my short course truck on on road. And you can get a. Um, Digital servo, surface servo, support by Spectrum. Let me just take a look at what these tires cost. They're about $15, $16. And yeah, if you're in the market for a, um, this has just been an update on the Torment. But yeah, if you're in the market for um, short course truck, two wheel drive, Strong and everything, basher or racer, you can probably race it. Uh, I don't know. I would race mine if I converted it. But yeah, definitely get it. And now this is a um, switching over kind of suddenly right here. This is a um, the Electric RC Smash. It is a 16th scale, I believe. 18th scale. It's a 18th scale monster truck. It's 79.99. And let's go to the multimedia, see what the pictures show. It's got a um, slipper clutch and everything, shocks, uh, aluminum drive shafts, dog bone. That's actually dog bone this time. Huh, that's new actually. More durable. I'm not, say I'm not saying that the plastic ones aren't durable, but I kind of torqued mine out on the ruckus, so I had to get new ones. Well, I replaced them with a metal gear one. Metal, metal, metal one. That's what the chassis looks like. The receiver and um, <clears throat> speed control all in one. You can't upgrade because it's got that um, three wired servo separate. I mean, I don't know. If you decide to put a stronger motor in or whatever, you can. I don't know. It's all your choice. It's got, it's just very nice looking all around. Oh yeah, and also I'm going to try to bring you guys update videos on what's happening in RC and everything. 
Well, kind of the new cars that come out. Anyway, yeah. Comes with a um, Electrix RC 27 megahertz radio system. Yes, you do get the crystals, but hey, I like it like that. I'm still using my controller over there with the long antenna. Probably need to get a new antenna. And here's the um, ESC receiver unit. And it's got the on and off switch connected to it, so there's no separate one. Like this is a um, prefix thing from the stock here. Show 15k, a ka 15l, something like that. I don't like it how the um, uh, the whatever switch is separate. But this one just mounts on the side, which is pretty cool. Can use. I think they have not uh, This one uses crystals too, and there's a three wired servo right there, so you can. Upgrade to whatever you want. And yeah, that's pretty much it. That's pretty much this update. And yeah. yeah it doesn't, no, it doesn't have parts and accessories yet. But yeah. Two wheel drive, 18 scale. Length is 9.37 inches. Width is 7.30 inches. Wheelbase, 5.60 inches. And yeah. That's pretty much all there is. Ready to run and all that. Motor is Dynamite 280. I'm guessing that's size or something. Yeah, that is size. Anyway, that's that's pretty much all for this. So I'll just give you guys an update on Electrix RC's or EX or ECX's brand new stuff, the Smash and the Torment. And yeah, that's pretty much it. You guys I mean, yeah, that's pretty much all there is to say about this stuff. You guys may be seeing the boost sometime soon. I don't know. But anyway, that's just been what's new for Electrix RC. Thank you for watching. Richard for two, check out electricsrc.com. You can just type it in in Google. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Check them out if you're in the market for an 18 scale, $79, 70 nine dollars yeah get it it's too well dropped you'll have lots of fun with it i mean just from looking at it i don't think i'll have lots of fun if i decide to get it and the torment i have the ruckus same chassis layout same gearing same electronics and i love it so right, if you're going to market for two wheel drive short course get the torment that's all there is to say thank you for watching richard for two have a great day bye